Father. Indeed, as you say, here I am. And what's more to the point, here you are. I... I, um... I was just entertaining me friend, Mr. Hennessy, to a cup of tea, Father, uh, to keep out the harshness of the morning. To break me fast, you know, Father. After communion. I don't remember seeing you at the altar rails, and I was not aware that the office of boiler man had free lodgings as one of his benefits. The thing is, Father, in the first week of the season, I, I do sleep here at night. I keep a slow fire going so as not to do harm to the pipes. And the dog's useful to you? In the matter of company, Father. Uh, himself and St. Francis ought to get on very well together. Where do you sleep? On the coke, is it? I do, Father. Sure, it could be worse. Only it doesn't help their bronchitis. No, I know it wouldn't. Oh, well, <clears throat> that'll be the, the dust. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't spend too much time in here if I were you. I tell you what, now. If you call on my housekeeper later on, I'll see that she gives you a bite of breakfast and uh, a few scraps for the dog. Mm -hmm. Do you take a drink at all? Whenever God in his goodness pushes a drop under me nose. Yes. Well, now I'll tell her to give you supper something to take home with you. God bless your father. For the bronchitis, you understand. <clears throat> oh, that's a Jason man. The heart is a roll. Well, I'm sure it's bronchitis as you have. And um, why haven't I? Wasn't it his chest that finished off King Eddie? Do you think bronchitis is too good for the likes of me? Is that it? King Eddie had a bad heart. And what's to stop my heart from getting bad, huh? <laughs> Still, wasn't it the mercy of God? It was tea we were drinking when he came in. <laughs> Boy, what else have you? <coughs> Port wine. Throw out that tea and give us your cup. <coughs> <coughs> and how did port wine come into your keeping? Oh, the housekeeper upstairs. She said there was three bottles of it. Someone must be very partial to the cup that shares. Oh, yeah. The man that's just gone out is. Now, the young priest is a bit straight laced in that respect. And now it's a bit early in the day for drinking. But if I was to leave it later in the day, I mightn't be offered it. Good health, sir. Oh, long life, dear. You know, with all the commotion about Lack and going to jail, you could do worse than make up a ballad about him. Be God, now there's an idea. I'm sure there'd be money in it. Yeah, and I got this the other day. Father Gifley made me a present of a shilling. And I thought to myself, so what harm if I squandered it? No, you didn't spend a shilling on that. No, I often spent more and got less for it. Just listen. Yeah, 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 you're not going to play it, are you? Don't be such an unmusical bousy here. Because when you think of it, haven't we got the life of Riley? 